Hello everyone, Game Crazy here, and welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Trigger. Attempt number two at fighting Magus. Spoiler, we're fighting Magus in a couple of minutes. So anyways, in the last episode we fought Ozzy, the Maxim Weirdo of the series. Today we are going to face Magus, the big boss of this, of this uh, area. There we go, hopefully that kills all those freaking bats. Cool, it killed them all. Oh, Robo leveled up this time. What? Whatever. Anyways, like I said, we're gonna be facing Magus. New Neuga Zaina Zayeberzom. Uh okay. Um anyways, we're gonna be facing Magus today. Uh also while I'm thinking about it, I gotta say this yet again. Uh, my next LP, it is going to be Dokutsu or Cave Story. It's not going to be the best ending just because I haven't actually played through the game that much. As of right now, I am only through like the second area. Uh, I have a reason for LPing it. You will see that in one of the early episodes. Uh, the reason is actually kind of funny, but uh, hey. It's a reason. Magus! It, it's that stupid frog. Kissed any princesses lately? I rather enjoy this form, and I owe it all to you. I have something for you. Ah, the mass immune. I bet you're just dying to use it. The black wind begins to blow. Okay, give me your best shot. If you're prepared for the void. So anyways, this is Magus. Magus, at the start of the fight, he's only going to be weak to one specific magic spell. And he will not reveal it up until he attacks with... Okay, that, uh, that tells me nothing. Geyser is what he's going to be using quite a bit of when he's not using his counterattack magic. Basically what Geyser does is, uh, fine, I'll use, uh, Laser Beam, because it's pretty much my weakest one. I don't really care if it happens to be wrong. Okay, it was wrong. If it's wrong, he heals and he, uh, damages you. Spell, uh, every type other than Darkness will damage everyone, so make sure everyone's at good health. Okay, so you did that. I'm gonna mid tonic you. Frog, attack him, get his magic defense down. I don't know if the magic defense down stack, or if it's just for a certain amount of time his magic defense is down. But either way, attacking with frog up until he changes to water barrier is pretty good. So okay, he's used, got a got, uh, he has a shadow barrier now. So what you'll want to do is you want to attack with Darkness. I probably should have healed up Glenn. It's a, generally a very good idea to have everyone above 100 HP before he uses his next spell. Well above 100 HP, because, uh... Yeah, that's why. If I were to heal him by 1 HP, he would have lived. Frog would have lived. Okay, so we shall... His barrier type is lightning, from what I remember. Let's see if I remember right for once. Uh, yes, I did. Sweet. Now his barrier is changing, only shadow damages. Chrono is taking the blunt of the damage. Uh, I'm going to heal up Chrono before I do anything else. And then I will attack with Frog and use laser spin. Basically, whenever you can, you do want to try and get in physical attacks with Glenn, just because his 
Mass immune, as it's saying up there, like every 500 seconds, decreases his magic defense. That'll make it the damage you actually can inflict on him right now do more. However, when he picks water, unless you have uh, Meryl with you, you are kind of making... You can't really use the strategy as much. Let's see, he'll use with that. He'll use with that. Use water. Yeah, like I said, with Meryl, you can't really do as much. It's generally a good idea to have either Robo or Luca with you when you come here. Yeah, and generally what you want to do is you either have Chrono or your non glen character on healing duty. And the uh, other character will basically just use the correct magic attack, assuming they have it. If no one has the correct magic attack, you just kind of got to stall it out. Okay, so this again. Chrono is going to have to be healed up. Uh, Robo probably should be healed up. Yeah, Robo should be healed up. Uh, probably Frog too. If I can actually get my controller to work. Anyways, there's the water. 214. Barrier change, only shadow damages. Shadow's just gonna hurt Glenn. yet again. Okay, we should be getting close to him doing that. Okay, we're definitely getting close. Okay, Magus risks casting a spell once he does this. One, make sure you are pretty decently healed up. You don't really want people dying here. Uh, I'm going to use Cure Beam. Heal. Okay, Frog has heal. I have to note that. A heal that heals everyone. It's not very good, but hey, it works. So anyways, with everyone healed up, uh, we can take Magus's attack that will be coming here. It is his strongest attack, as the game will be telling us here. Uh, we're gonna at least take one. Yeah, we gotta take one. Dark Matter, Magus' strongest attack. The power of a black space triangle with a white triangle inside of it. As you can see, that very nearly wiped us out. Okay, can I attack you? Okay, Magus is going to risk casting yet another spell. So, yet again, I say let's heal up with Glenn's magic. I keep one to, I keep switching over from calling him Glenn to Frog. Curse my naming strategy. Anyways, yet again, uh, heal everyone up to decent amounts. We're all pretty good. And then just go all out. Might even be worth it to maybe wait for a triple raid. Ooh, that was really, really bad timing. You really don't want to use an attack right after that. Uh, but I should... Okay, I'm decent enough. Maybe if I'm lucky, this might kill him. <laughs> uh... Nope, no death, no death. Mid-tonic. Mid-tonic. I hate my controller, it's so sticky. That can totally be taken wrong. Okay, Chrono attack. Heal. Chrono attack again. I'm just gonna physical attack, because that only did like 800 damage. I can get at least that much from all my physical attacks put together. If not more, just because Frog has a heightened critical chance. 
There we go. Dark Matter, Magus' strongest attack. Okay, so we've gotten hit by two. He should be about done here. Midtonic. Midtonic again. I'm not doing that bad. All things considered. Midtonic. Attack. Okay, technique. We're gonna heal and hit again with Frog. And then we're just gonna pound away the A button, making sure we keep hitting Magus. Let's see, there's about 400, maybe 500 damage there. 1500 experience points, 15 technique points, we beat him. 3000 gold, chrono levels up. Well, what have you done to the mass immune? We did it. We saved the world. Destroyed the guy who is going to awaken Lavos. It's a large-scale energy reaction. Could it be Lavos? Bad timing. Don't wake up on me now. What do you mean? According to my records, Lavos was born here at this precise moment. You fools! I only summoned him! He lives in the inner earth, absorbing the land's power and growing ever stronger. Then my data must be incorrect. What's going on? Impossible! A gate this large should not exist! You! If you hadn't shown up! It's an enormous gravity well! Whoa! Get me off this crazy thing! So, where, or when did we end up? Chrono? Chrono! Wake up, Chrono! Are we at the beginning of the game? What? Honey, you'll be late for work! I'd forgotten how beautiful lean spells could sound. Chrono, we can't keep sponging off my dad. Sponging off my dad? What? Go and get a job! Sponging? <laughs> Chrono! The heck does the word spun? Sponging? Chrono, 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 Sponging. So... Hey, look, it's Isla. Chrono awake. Miss Isla, which means we're... Isla had strange dream. Went to Mystic Mountains. Everyone lie there, hurt. I carry back to hut. Magus! Yummy frog for Isla eat. P perish the thought, lass. By the way, whither the blue-haired one? Only find you there. Blue hair, one more tasty. We have lost him. If Magus didn't create Lavos, then in what era was it born? Lavos, not worry now. You rest. Hurt bad. Chrono okay now? Isla busy. Look for La Ruba village. Fight reptiles together. Destroy reptiles or we no survive. Kino! Or Kino! What happened? Quiet. Chrono rest. Northwood burning. Okay, and with that, I will see you guys next time for Let's Play Chrono Trigger. If you like this video, you no, know, like, comment, subscribe, whatever.
Anyways, I will see you next time where we go to the Northwood and try and help with this burning problem. That... That sounded a little more messed up than I thought it would. See you guys next time. Bye.